is up guys welcome to league play part eight if you're new to this series or came across this uh it's black ops 2 league play in the the team deathmatch series um and uh i started off doing my own class setups and uh, this is the the third um number six number seven and uh this the one number eight was uh from subscribers so um if you have got a class setup that you want to recommend um, you can use anything um, as bad or as good as you want to use and uh, leave a comment down below and I get through as many as I can in as quick time as possible so anyway this one is from Kane Lostich and the gun that I was told to use was the the MAA one with select fire and four grip and uh, wild cards perk to greed with perks ghost toughness scavenger dexterity and the lethal was C4 and tactical was EMP. Um, I'm glad I got the C4 because I like to use the C4. It's always good to have, um, especially if you come across situations where you want to reload. And uh, you've always got the C4 there because um, I don't tend to carry a secondary that much. Um, I did stick with the score streaks that I will use um, if you don't su uh, suggest score streaks as well. And that is UAV, Hunter Killer, and Hellstorm, just for the fact that they are. Um, quick score streaks to get and uh, it is only team deathmatch so it is good um, it's good to use low ones obviously UAV helps everyone out as well hunter killer is pretty much a guaranteed kill and as well as hellstorm you always got the chance of picking up a triple if you hit the spawn at the right time and stuff like that so the MAA one um, I don't tend to use it that much um, if I if I was playing online for fun like just uh, on on public matches and not league play um, I wouldn't I wouldn't use it that much but um, to be honest, it is a good gun, um, and uh, I can't really cover it too much because it's a bit late in the game now to start covering guns and telling you what the best attachments are. But um, if I say, I would say, if you wish to use any attachments, I'd say uh, Select Fire is quite a good one, um, is quite good for this gun. But then again, if you do like three round burst, um, um, you know, prefer that just over accuracy and stuff. Then uh, also is a good gun to use, like for the bigger maps, like longer range. That's where the um, the uh, free round burst comes into play, um, just for being more accurate at distance. Um, if you're not using snipers and you like to use assault rifles on the big maps, which is quite good, uh, quite good to do. Um, that's ten. That's how I tend to play it. Really, um, I'd say select fire is only really good for smaller maps. Um, but nonetheless, this is a good gun, and I do like it. And uh, the class setup was good. It wasn't too, it wasn't too overpowered, so to put it. Um, as I say, take out fast hands in most of the classes that you're going to give because fast hands is um, a pretty good, pretty good uh, perk perk to have. Um, obviously, coming out of the C4, going back into into your gun and stuff like that a lot quicker. So. So yeah, feel free to go however crazy you want with the class. Um, you'll notice as well, I spoke about, I uploaded Minecraft yesterday or the day before, whenever I decide to put this video up. Um, I have slowed down on uploads. I did explain in that video, if you are curious, um, as to why. I'm, I'm not stopping YouTube, I've just slowed down a little bit. I did speak about it a lot more in that, so I'm not gonna speak about it too much in this. But um, yeah, great little class setup. I enjoyed using it, it was, it was really fun. Um, and uh, I'm glad I got scavenger with it as well because obviously using C4, um, getting a gun kill and then running over the body, picking up scavenger, getting another C4 is always good. Um, EMP grenade, um, I don't know if that's a, a big favourite with people who are suggesting classes but a lot of the classes that I have had, um, people have said to use uh, EMP grenades so must just be a favourite of yours, maybe you don't want me to use flashbangs but EMP grenades can be good, um, destroying, destroying Betty's other people see for um, sentry guns and stuff like that so so they do come in come in pretty handy in the game but yeah as I say if you enjoy this um, make sure to hit the like button um, show the support on the video all that good stuff um, I did come back for this person and I'm glad I did because uh, that's where game winning kill was but yeah this is uh, the team deathmatch so if anyone I've had people in the past comment saying um, you can't use UAV in uh, in league play this is a team deathmatch one um, I like to play team, team deathmatch because it's shorter games and uh, it's nice just to get these little class setups done in short games and uh, team deathmatch don't last too long. So uh, there it is, the MAA1. Um, I wasn't able to get the scorecard up at the end. I'm not sure when. I, I think I went back into theatre to get it and I, I can't remember if I pushed it or not. Um, Aura was recording at the time and it started lagging a little bit right here and then it just skipped past the scorecard. I'm not too sure. But there it is. Hope you enjoyed the video and uh, I will see you in the next one. Cheers for watching.